So I've got a Hey Little Magpie haul. I've obviously opened the box already. I didn't really want to wait. So the first thing I want to point out about this is that I bought all of this stuff in the Hey Little Magpie sale. They recently had a big sale and they also had an extra 20% off, I think, with a discount code. As far as shipping goes, they have one of the best UK services. I ordered it in the morning and the following morning it had arrived. So for £3.95 shipping, I think that is a really decent service. So yeah, some of these have prices on, but that's not how much I paid. So the first thing that I got with these, they are day stickers, so they've got the days of the week, and they've also got a couple of blank ones, which you could add your own thing into. And that pack was 1 99 and I'm planning to use these in my creative journaling. Because one of my journals is an undated notebook, I put the date at the top of my pages, but obviously I don't really put the like day of the week so I thought it'd be nice to use these at the top of those pages as well. I then got these stamps which are by Studio L2E um, and they are the documented month stamps so you just get January to December and you get the little numbers as well which you can put in the boxes so I guess you could put the year or you could also put like the day of that month that you're documenting and they were £7.48. Next I got these which in the sale they had a lot of Christmas and Halloween stuff which I didn't mind buying because obviously those two events are coming up quite soon. So I picked up these which are the kind of countdown to Christmas, um, so countdown to the 25th of December cards. So there's 25 pieces in there and they just look like this. So I thought it might be nice to do a kind of mini project um, and get an album for these. They're kind of perfect size for Instagram photos and they were $1.99. Again, another kind of Christmas item. I haven't actually seen this before and I really, really liked how they were kind of dulled down Christmas so like they're still Christmassy but they're not in your face Christmassy so they'd be perfect for either pocket letters, journaling, smash booking, scrapbooking, whatever I fancy using them for and in the pack you get 36 sheets so you get two of each design basically and this pad was £2.99. I then got these two sets of alphabet stickers. I've kind of been collecting tiny alphabet stickers and stamps and stuff because as you guys know I'm planning to use my Bando planner as a journal and the space that there is to journal isn't massive whether it's to kind of caption the day or you know word of the day or anything like that. Yeah I think they'll come in handy and they were both 49p each. So we then go on to the 12 by 12 papers. I bought these ones, like I chose these ones myself out of all the ones they had on there, but I also bought a grab bag at the end. They have those available and I remember I picked one up last time. I think they're highly worth it. You don't know what you're getting, obviously, um, but they're 3 dollars for 20 sheets, which I think is a really good deal. So I'll show you those ones last. These are the ones I chose, so I'm going to go through those. So I'm actually going to start with the kind of Halloween themed ones that I got. And this was actually like a whole pack. And this pack was £7.98. Um, and you get a lot of different things in it. So you get like the 12 by 12 papers. But you also get stickers and little sticker sheets and stuff. And journaling cards. So yeah, I'm just going to show you what's in this pack. Um, so this is like the kind of front cover of the pack. Which I think I could probably still use this for something. So this is the first sheet. And the back is just black and white and it has little white dots on it. This is probably one of my favourites. It's just got little ghosts on it and they've got little bow ties and stuff. And the back just has some Halloween words on it. There's then this one which is kind of Halloween colours but floral pattern. And on the back is just orange diamond pattern. There's then a classic skull pattern. And on the back is stars in the Halloween colours. This is another one of my favourites. It's just got tiny little pumpkin heads with different faces on. And on the back is just kind of a Halloween gingham. There's then a Halloween cupcake pattern. And on the back is green with little white stars. There's then two of these, which is basically Halloween borders. So you could... You could keep it as like one and cut sections out of it or you could cut strips out and use them as borders on things. And on the backs is just blue diamonds. Next is some which are kind of like journaling cards and again you get two sheets of these. Um, and on the back is kind of like a grey wood pattern. You then get two little sticker sheets um, and on these ones there is just some kind of fold over tab 
style ones. There's then this sheet which has more Halloween stickers on and these will be really fun to use to decorate my pages around Halloween time. And then lastly there's this 12 by 12 sticker sheet which has a kind of mixture of everything so it's got some borders, the alphabet, it's got some little phrases, um, it's got some of the fold over tabs. So yeah I was gonna buy just this sheet on its own and then I saw that the paper pack had the stickers in it so I thought I might as well just go for the whole pack. But then we go on to the single sheets that I chose. So we then go on to the ones which came in the grab bag. So I got all of the following papers for $3.99 and there's 20 here. Obviously I didn't know what I was getting but I'm pretty chuffed with the ones that I got. So this was everything that I bought from Hey Little Magpie. I ended up spending a total of £28.11 and, and that includes the postage, the products with all the discounts and stuff. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. I will leave a link to Hey Little Magpie in the description. I only tend to buy from there when they have a massive sale on. I only tend to buy from anywhere when they have a massive sale on. I think that is just the bargain hunter in me. I have always been that way. So yeah, they don't have the sale on anymore. But if you're from the UK and you want to find a UK seller of the kind of American brands I would definitely recommend Hey Little Magpie because their service is just brilliant and if you follow them on Instagram or Facebook or anywhere like that then they'll always notify you on there um, about the sales so yeah thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video